Sighing under her mask, Tazal paced back to the rope ladder leading down to the city below. So, Knight, I shall meet you below. If we linger up here, people might think we have put aside our rivalry. Without waiting, she climbed the side of the ladder to gain momentum. She knew the old knight would be a bit slower and more cautious at his own descent. Landing on a platform just inside the city, Kazao found another of the withers waiting for her. Greetings with a Kazao, the woman said. The woman's faceplate was glowing white, which meant she was one of the nine that watched over the larger affairs of the guild. I am with her Rose. Rose Widow, Kazao said, gasping and taking a few steps back. Very few were ever witness to the widow. Most assumed she was made up to keep younger members in line. Pratchett phased in next to Rose and danced about happily. Her superior knelt down and patted the mimic affectionately. And this must be Pratchett. I have heard much of both of you. He is adorable. Stepping forward, Kazal bowed. It is an honor to meet you. If you are my contact here, then... Oh no. Nodding, Rose removed her mask to reveal the eight eyes beneath. I fear it is a necessity, Kazal. From here, your new home is Roanoke.